Imagine waking up in 2050 and the earth is devastated by human activities. Picture this, New York is scorching hot and LA is frozen cold. We are no longer talking about the consequences of climate change, we are actually living it. Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos once had the idea of colonizing Mars, but it turned out the red planet was pretty tough to live on because of stuff like microgravity, cosmic radiation, and tough environments. Now billionaires are thinking of other places. Maybe floating cities in the clouds of Venus would be their next hope. The surface of Venus is extremely harsh, but about 30 miles above the planet, the gravity is 90% of the gravity on Earth, and the atmospheric conditions are somewhat similar to our planet. But the challenges are still significant. For instance, any floating habitats need to withstand hurricane-like winds that frequently hit Venus. So while Venus has strong potential, for some, there is a bigger vision. Like Bishop rings or O'Neill cylinders. Jeff Bezos wants to put people in space by creating large rotating megastructures. They essentially create gravity through their rotation, creating habitats where people can live and work. Jeff thinks moving heavy industry into space will help us preserve the Earth. But assembling such a megastructure in our solar system wouldn't be easy. First, we need to find the materials. One option would be to mine asteroids, but the logistics would be so tricky. It's too dangerous to send the humans to do the work. So we need to utilize AI robots to build the structures for us. Lastly, we need to make sure that it's safe from cosmic radiation and space particles. Plus, we need to get the basics like food, water, and air. And we have barely even scratched the surface. We dream of new worlds, but our Earth needs us. Before we leave our own planet, don't you think we should at least try to fix it? You decide. Let me know your thoughts below.